Hello, welcome to my channel. In this video, I will show you how to crochet this pretty little Christmas tree, which is about four and a half inches tall and is easy to make. I am going to use this white cotton thread size 10 and my hook uh, that is 1.95 millimeters. Of course, the tree can be green with the red top and the brown trunk, but I like white color. Um, seems more um, wintry to me this way. We are going to start here with the magic loop, and in the magic loop, we'll be making double crochets, groups of three double crochets separated by chain three. So I'm making a magic loop like this. I will close it a little and we'll make the first double crochet, which is chain three. And now two more double crochets. One, two. So this is the first group of three. Now chain three and three more double crochets. One, two, three. Chain three. Now instead of three, I am making two double crochets. And for a loop hanger, I'll make chain about 30. Three, four, five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty five, thirty. Enough. And I'll make a slip stitch in the top of the second double crochet. And one more double crochet. This way we have made three groups of three double crochets. Now we'll need to make four more groups like this. Chain three and uh, three double crochets. So I have made the fourth one. Please continue working and make three more groups of three double crochets separated by chain three. I have finished those four groups and all together I have seven. Now I can close the magic loop completely. And instead of the last chain three, I'll make a double crochet in the third chain. And now we are going to use these two groups to be more exact, chain, this chain three, to start the tree itself. So we are here now and in this chain three, we'll make three groups of three double crochets separated by chain three. We'll turn work over at the beginning of every row and every row will start uh, with three slip stitches. We'll make the first in the second double crochet, one in the last double crochet, and one in chain three. And now chain three instead of the first double crochet, and the two more double crochets chain three, three double crochets, chain three, three double crochets, three seems to be a magic number for this pattern. Okay, the first row is ready. 
Now we are going to start and end every row with the same shell consisting of three double crochets, chain three, three double crochets. And in the middle, we'll start making this triangle. So turn work over, make three slip stitches to get to the first chain three space. Make chain three instead of the first double crochet and two more double crochets. Chain three and three double crochets. So this is the first shell. In this second row of the tree, we'll make chain three between those shells. And the last shell. Three double crochets. Chain three. Three double crochets. On the other side, once again, we are making three slip stitches, chain three, two more double crochets, chain three, three double crochets, chain three and now in the second of those three chain stitches we'll make a double crochet chain three and the usual group of three double crochets chain three three double crochets Turn work over, three slip stitches, three double crochets, chain three, three double crochets. chain three and now in this double crochet we'll make three one two three chain three and the last shell in this round in this row And let's make one more row together. Three slip stitches. A shell. chain three and beginning uh, with this round we'll start doubling the first and the last double crochet here in the center in each row so two double crochets in the first double crochet of the previous round one in the middle and two in the last double crochet chain three 
and a shell. So in this row, in the middle, we have made five double crochets. And so far, we have made five rows in the tree. Continue working this pattern, please. We are now here and we'll need to make five more rows. In the next one, there will be seven double crochets in the middle, then nine, 11, 13, and 15. After that, cut off thread and I'll show how to make the trunk. I have finished making the tree itself. I have made 10 rows in total, cut off the thread, and now I'm going to turn it over. And I will skip the first two double crochets of the triangle in the middle. We'll insert the hook in the third double crochet, and we'll make the first double crochet of the trunk, which is chain three. And now, working this uh, thread in, I will be making double crochets, stitch in stitch. So I have made three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So there are eleven double crochets in the trunk, and we'll make another row of the trunk this is the first double crochet chain three and now the second the next four five six seven eight nine and number 11 will go in the third chain of the three chains of the beginning of the previous row and that's it cut off the thread use a needle to weave in the end of the thread And make sure you pass the needle at least two times in different directions here where we made the magic ring to make sure it's secure. And now the tree is ready. You can leave it as is or you can um, starch it to uh, make it a little harder to give it a more uh, pronounced shape. This is it for today. If you liked the video, please push the like button. And if you want to be informed of all the new developments on the channel, consider subscribing and pushing the notification button. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye bye.